It's not too often you see a big smile on the faces of students as they head back to school, but that definitely was the case for students and parents alike when they got their first glimpse inside the newly built Francis H. Clerk French Immersion Public School. Close to 3,000 people toured the two-story building during a recent open house staged by the Algoma District School Board. I'm so pleased that so many people in the community have come out to see uh, this new school. I think this is a wonderful day for not only the Algoma District School Board, but also for the community and certainly for the kids who will be attending the school. Uh, this school will serve kids for the next uh, 50 to 75 years, and it's, uh, it's a, the type of school that I, I would believe rivals any school in the province of Ontario. Funding for the $15.5 million school was provided by the Ontario government. I'm very pleased with it. Uh, what makes me very pleased about it is seeing the smiling faces on the parents and the students. Uh, there are sons and daughters that are coming in here uh, saying that this is a great place uh, where they can learn and get their education, uh, and that's what it's all about. The two-story school will house 680 students from junior kindergarten to grade 3, as well as grade 7 and 8. In Sault Ste. Marie, it's been a while since we've had money into our infrastructure with respect to capital planning and new schools. And it's a real privilege uh, to be uh, part of the ADSB administrative team and to actually have um, the privilege of um, greeting students on opening day, September 6th. It's actually it's beautiful. Uh, my kids went to the old schools and now I've got a daughter that's going to be supply teaching in the new schools. So it's a little bit of history. It's a lot bigger and I think the classrooms are designed a little bit more differently geared towards the students depending on what grades they're in. We have some specialized classrooms that we didn't have at the other schools. So I think those are things that will really help out and also with um, the playgrounds and everything like that. It's going to be safety all enclosed and everything. So I, I think it's going to be really, really fun and I'm going to uh, have a lot of fun with different teachers. Did you see your classroom? Yes. Tell me about it. Um, I liked it and I get to sit by myself. Do you think you're going to have fun here? Are some of your friends coming here too? Yeah. I think it's awesome. This looks like an amazing school. It's going to be full of new memories and I can't wait to attend it this coming fall. The first day of classes for Algoma District School Board students is Tuesday, September 6th. For Shaw TV, I'm Tony Telebracci.